looks better out in the open. Oh yeah. I can start it right there, but it'd probably be more cool for me not to start it there, huh? Whatever. Oh wow. Starts right up. It doesn't start that great when it's when it's cold. cold. It starts pretty good. Is it an automatic choke? Yeah. Automatic choke? Yes. It is. <laughs> it, uh, the engine looks gigantic after working on my Model A. <laughs> I, every time I get this thing after not driving it for a while, I'm mm -hmm. amazed at how quickly it accelerates. A lot of torque, I bet. A lot of torque. Not that many horsepower. Not a lot of RPMs. No, but it's definitely got torque. I mean, you can just watch that speedometer just come up like that as your just normal acceleration. Mm -hmm. Compared to my Toyota, yeah, you know when I get out on the oh yeah action road there, a lot of times I really got to floor it to get going fast enough for the people behind me to. That's because they get all uh, their horsepower at 6,500 RPM. Yeah, right. Not at 1,800. Yeah. Okay, close her up. We got to go see if we can capture some exhaust tone. It's so quiet. Did you rev it up just a little bit? Not sure how well this will pick up in here, but. Does this go out to the road if I go this way? Yeah. Smells like a 50s car. Yeah, it does. They all have their own little smell. Yeah. Radio work? Uh, let's see, does it? You know, that's a good question. I think it does. Let's see. Uh, let's see. You know, I, I've had it working, but I don't think it works. I've poked around at a number of old tube car radios. Got them all to work, but they're you, finicky. Usually all I gotta do is get through uh you can go, working. Yeah, give it a tonk. Pretty smooth ride. And the Model A uh, bumps around pretty good on this road. It really comes into its own on the freeway. That's where it's Well, I've never ridden in a Hudson before. <laughs> nice and roomy. Oh, yeah. Let's see, I guess. Probably doesn't run. <laughs> <laughs> 